Hello everyone. How are you today? Are you ready for a story? Watch out! The tiger is here. That is going to be today's story. And the author of the story is Sejal Mehta. And the illustrator is Rohan Chakravarti. The publisher of this book is Pratham Books. It's not easy being a tiger. Yes, tigers are beautiful and fierce. So this is a tiger. And the author says, it's not easy being a tiger. We all think what? Oh, it's a huge animal. It's a beautiful, huge animal. I'm sure it has a life of a king, right? But he says, it's not easy being a tiger. Let us see why. But tigers are also big and heavy. This makes it difficult for them to hunt for food. Ah, they have a disadvantage being so big and heavy. What is it? It is very difficult for them to hunt food, right? They are big and everybody can then see them. Out of every 20 times a tiger hunts, it eats only once. Oh, so we see what the disadvantage is, right? Being big and heavy. What happens? Every 20 times it hunts, it, it's probably successful only once. So it is tough. So every time it moves around being big, it is being seen by everybody around. It cannot sneak and surprise its prey that easily. When a tiger moves through the forest, <coughs> the langur calls, just like an old man coughing. <coughs> The langur, this is the langur. Langur is also called as the Hanuman monkey. It's a type of monkey. So whenever it spots a tiger, what happens? It gives an alarm call to all the other animals around saying that, hey, I have spotted a tiger now. So all the other animals and birds are now alert. Since the monkey is at the top of the tree, it can easily spot the tiger. And the tiger is big, so you cannot miss the tiger. Oh! Oh! The barking deer calls like a scared dog. Oh! Oh! This is the barking deer. This is this type of deer. Look at it. This is the deer. It's called as the barking deer. It makes an alarm call the minute it senses that there is a tiger around. And that call is like, it sounds like a scared dog. How does it sound? Like that it is. So that also alerts the rest of the animals around saying, hey, the tiger is here. The spotted deer calls like a little bird. Ow! 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 Not just the langur or the barking deer, the spotted deer. You would have seen them in zoos or even in the forest. It is very common in India. The spotted deer also makes its call saying, the tiger is here. Poor tiger. Everybody seemed to notice him. The whole forest knows the tiger is here. Huh? Huh? The tiger wonders, where has everyone gone? So now that the entire forest knows that the tiger is around, what happens? The tiger is not able to find its prey. Everybody is finding a safe hiding place and hiding from the tiger. This story doesn't have any difficult words as such. But the three animals mentioned other than the tiger 
are langur, barking deer and the spotted deer. You would have seen both the langur and the spotted deer very easily either in a forest or in a zoo. In a zoo you would have seen the barking deer as well. Uh, these are the photos of the langur, barking deer and spotted deer. Try these questions. Poor tiger, it struggles so much to get its prey. What strategy or idea can it use to make it easy? Do you have any tips for the tiger? What is a food chain? Draw the food chain of a tiger. I hope you enjoyed today's story. I thought that the illustrations were extremely beautiful. Until next time, this is bye from Soumya.